What's up everyone, this is Bomblock again and I'm bringing you another episode of my money making guide. And for this episode we're gonna collect Infernal Ashes. The requirements here for our 80 Slayer for the monsters that we're doing. But they're also dropped by Black Demons which don't have a requirement so... But yeah, these are kinda slower money per hour but you can do them instead if you want. So as you can see I'm just using Malie Gear in my inventory prayer potions, extreme set, some rock tails because I have to go through a few wildy levels and there could be Pikares there so I bring a few the claws for the special attack, the yak to store the infernal ashes in and a glory to tally back to Edgeville. So I go out of Edgeville, jump over the ditch into the wilderness and be careful because there could be Pikares in here. Go down the rift and note that you can't go down if you're under attack. You take the northwestern portal then yet again the northwestern portal after that the northeastern portal then the portal right next to it and note here are the black demons which you can kill to get infernal ashes also and we're almost there and it's really easy to remember if you do it once or twice so alright and we're at the necreal which we're gonna kill to get the infernal ashes as a drop so we're just gonna attack them and you'll see that they drop infernal ashes and these ashes are currently about 2k each and for this I use turmoil. You can also use piety if you don't have a uh, 95 prayer. The necreal also drop a lot of herb seeds which are kinda pricey and these add up to the money you're making per hour. You can use the yak scrolls to bank the infernal ashes and the other items that you're getting as a drop. I'm just not using them in this video because I want to time how long one trip takes so. You, you probably also like to know that these drop a lot of crimson charms and 200 kills gets you an easy 60, 70 crimson. That's good for summoning as well. So Also know that these infernal ashes are used for prayer. And they give slightly less prayer XP than the dragon bones. So they're kind of bound to stay just under the dragon bone price. So if these go down that means prayer will get a lot of cheaper. It's also possible to bring a steel titan or another titan to kill these things faster. Because they're multi. But I wouldn't really bother doing that because then you can... Running here from the bank again takes longer than the amount it makes up to using the yak. Here you can see the result of a 10 minute trip. The infernal ashes are about 2k each and the total value was about 115k. The ashes sold a little over mid price and so it was about 120k times 6 which is almost 700k per hour. So I hope you guys enjoyed another part of my money making series and you can leave a comment if you have any questions.